Good guys, welcome back to the first take. I'm Ed Reese, and uh, we have something different today, like a little short film. I'm not really sure how to even explain this one because I'm not even sure what the fuck we're gonna watch. But a bunch of sites have been showing this, posting this up, saying that it's a total head fuck, but it's amazing at the same time. Uh, <laughs> we'll see, it's five minutes, so get comfortable. It's called The Chicken Inn. Yeah, I know. Apparently, it's some sort of. Uh, parody or piss take of The Shining, you know, the Kubrick classic starring Jack Nicholson. So let's check this out. I'm not sure what the fuck to expect. It's by a guy called Nick Ben Boa. So yeah, let's see what they created. And if it's crazy, it's insane. Welcome to Charlie's Chicken World and Restaurant Resort. This is the largest fast food entertainment complex in North America with a subterranean farm, a power plant, oh, and the world's only magnificent chicken blast fry. Tough of the film. And you be the new senior chief night manager. Now, does that sound like what you're looking for? Well, it sounds fine to me. Yeah, you call this a sandwich? Oh, that is creepy. Oh, what about Tony? <laughs> what about me? Get back in the kitchen and make me a real sandwich. Like you're <laughs> the mouth. Maybe straighten out your eyes. Oh, that's messed up, man. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> this is sacrilege. <laughs> We'll blindfold the chicken with tiny little band-aids and then we just Brown them in a spice of barbecue sauce and pluck all the tail feathers with a shop vac and a pair of surgical clamps. Do you mind if I ask why you do that? <laughs> Alfonso, do you mind just keeping it down a bit? The big people are talking here. And other than that, no other problems. Oh, except the toilets sometimes receive volcanic pressure blasts that explode feces all over the walls of the bathroom. Oh, this is fucked up. <laughs> A worried amount of time went into this. <laughs> Hello. The volcano sauce pressure tank is located in room 237. So as we gotta go into room 237 and take out the volcano sauce pressure tank. Room 237? Yeah, room 237. 237. Am I not speaking clearly? You just gotta go in there and distract that big crazy chicken oh, so me and creepy. Tony can plant the explosives. Who's Tony? Who the fuck am I? Who the fuck are you, you green ass piece of shit? Torrance, hello! How are you? Okay, would you like to try the new experimental sauce, the shiny volcano sauce? I'm awfully glad you're asking, Lloyd. <laughs> Well done, okay, listen up. Hello. We have a spicy, a super spicy, tasty spicy. We have a super shiny spicy, and we have a super duper shiny spicy suicide sauce. Hey, it has the essence of a real natural <laughs> volcano right in the inside of the red drum, red drum, red drum. Oh, sorry, I meant burger. I'm dyslexic, didn't I tell you? Okay, this is a head fuck. This Ever is a since head we fuck. moved here, you've been acting more and more like a chicken. <laughs> wow! The volcano sauce pipes is gonna blow. This stuff. Direct 
director Stanley Kubrick comes a new twist on a classic tale of horror. The Chickening Rated R. What can you say about that? I don't... I don't have the words to articulate what the fuck I just saw. Like seriously, what the fuck? Never has the term or the letters WTF be more appropriate than to describe what the fuck that was. <laughs> Some evil geniuses that were behind that. And I say evil geniuses because the fact that the amount of hard work for those that have never seen The Shining and aren't familiar with some of the footage that they used, basically what these guys have done, I think that there's a few of these. I'm, I'm starting to see a lot of these type of videos around on YouTube where they take a trailer or footage from a film. And there was one, there was a Harry, Harry Potter one I was watching a while back where they just kind of manipulate and just do fuck up people's eyes and just do weird shit. But that takes the shit to the extreme. But it's actually a lot of work put into it, like I was saying, because they've overlaid all these mad shit going on. Like that scene where Jack Nicholson is in, because uh, they take over this uh, hotel, and the one where he's sitting at a bar, but they've changed it into like a <laughs> like a chicken shop, whatever the fuck they called it, the chicken or whatever the fuck it was, place was called. That's really well done. The one where the two twin girls are dancing in the hallway. That's it's pretty clever. But, totally head fuck at the same time I don't even know how you'd plan out something like this but yeah you gotta give it up for the the hard work the obvious amount of hard work that went into this so yeah Nick uh, Demboa I'm gonna put a link to the original video down below give it a proper look see for yourself man it's definitely gonna be shit you probably missed probably shit I missed if I watch it again oh and there's a Davy Force as well was involved in this so check it out it was official selection for TIFF 40 and Sundance 2016 so this shit is this is getting some big ass exposure this ain't even some random YouTube shit uh, these people are pushing this and people are taking notice for the insanity I, I would be I would love to know what the reaction in a cinema would be for this like if they showed this you know instead of showing shitty freaking ads before movies in the cinema, before they even get to the trailers, they've got all the damn adverts. Get rid of those, show a short film, show something like that. I would love to see the reaction of everyone around it. Just the sheer, what the fuck? People crying, kids breaking down, like it's got. <laughs> yeah, that's mad. That's nuts. What do you guys think? Let me know. You familiar with The Shining? Are you impressed how they kind of fucked around with it? Or are you, have you never seen The Shining and you kind of curious to check out what the fuck it's about? After seeing this in the contents of the film, uh, let me know, man. Write your comments down below. You like the video? Please subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. I am Eddie Reese. This has been my first take to Nick Bem Demboa and Davy Forces the Chicken in. Ugh, fucking mad, mad, mad! I tell you. Oh.